Researchers at university hospitals have discovered a way to get life-saving therapy to cancer patients at a much faster rate than ever before. And this could just be the beginning of the types of diseases CAR T cell therapy can fight. As News 5's Jesse Schultz reports, if this clinical trial is a success, university hospitals will be one of the only ones in the country to offer this type of turnaround time for the therapy. In 2018, Jack and Judy Boyle had big plans for retirement. We love cruising, cruising and mm -hmm, yeah. transatlantic cruises. You know, we like the long ones. But they hadn't planned for a devastating diagnosis. At the time, 65-year-old Jack went in for a routine doctor's appointment. He opted in for a full body scan. A day later, I got a call saying, you know, we found something, a mass on the right side of your neck. Jack had an aggressive form of follicular lymphoma. The two put his care in the hands of the doctors at university hospitals. For more than four years, he tried different treatments, but nothing worked until his doctor suggested CAR T cell immunotherapy. They literally harvest your T cells, then they take them to their lab in this case, uh, and they reprogram them. Doctors then put those modified cells back in your body. When all goes well, these cells uh, start growing and recognizing the cancer and destroying it. Dr. Kuhn Van Basseen is the chief of hematology at UH's Seidman Cancer Center. He says CAR T therapy is effective with forms of lymphoma and leukemia, but there were some downfalls. One of the limitations is that it takes anywhere between three and five weeks to produce these cells. Time some patients didn't have. They cannot wait for these uh, the, for that length of time. But now a breakthrough. Researchers at Seidman have streamlined the time it takes to manufacture those cells from three to five weeks to just 24 to 48 hours. It also provides a lot of promise for other forms of cancer. In August, Jack's first scan after CAR T therapy was clear for the first time in more than four years. It wiped out everything. They're hopeful with the even faster turnaround in the future, more patients can experience that feeling. After you've been going at it for that long and nothing else has really worked and then this was so amazing. And for the first time in years, they're making plans for the future, taking their great granddaughter with them too. She's asked since she was about four years old, you know, when can I travel with you and Papa? And so we are going to be taking her on the cruise to Alaska. Reporting for News 5, I'm Jesse Schultz.